Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, Podians. The dogs have already had their breakfast. They've already gone outside a few times. Jamie and I are getting ready. <laughs> I know. <laughs> uh, did they fit? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's what I figured. Sure. <laughs> Jamie and I are getting ready to uh, go transport a couple of huskies. You're going to sit here and chill all day, huh? Yeah. We'll turn the TV on for you. You guys can watch some TV. How's that sound? We're going to go help rescue a couple huskies. What do you think? Oh, were you digging? Yeah. yeah can I you tell? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know. Were you digging? What's on your face, Shelby? Look here. Look, sit. What's, in, what's on your face? Look at that. <laughs> All right, you girls be good. I think Brittany's gonna come over and let you out. And Greg will probably come over and let you out if we run later. And uh, yeah, we will return. <laughs> so we're here picking up the dogs. So this is Ghost. She is borderline feral. She's terrified of us. She's terrified of everything. She doesn't wanna be touched. She's gonna need a lot of work, but gosh, is she pretty. She's just scared. She's from an abuse case. Flew up here from Georgia. Yeah. Gosh, she's so pretty. Yeah, you are. All right, we have loaded up the dogs. This is Ghost. Uh, she's a little bit, um, I keep saying she's feral. She's a little scared of people, not too sure of anything. She seems to be doing good now that we've kind of got her in the kennel and got her in the car. And then this is Blue. And Blue is actually pretty friendly. He's like, I like people and I like things. I'm just not sure about what's going on. So Blue was from downstate. He was pulled from a high kill shelter, I believe. And then um, Ghost in the back was actually pulled with another dog named Mufasa and they came all the way up from Georgia. So she actually yesterday flew on an airplane. You fly on an airplane? I saw that picture of the pilot holding you so I know you can be picked up, but you also might've had some puppy Xanax to help you out. So, yeah. Anyway, we're going to continue on our trip. Three more hours and you'll be where you need to be for a while. What are you doing? Telling us, this, singing us a song? <laughs> yeah? Good boy. We're singing us a song? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> what else? <laughs> yeah? Oh, I love you too. What a, I love you too. <laughs> I love you. Yeah. <laughs> He's a talker. Are you a talker? I would. He's like, yep, I sure am. <laughs> I'm a talker. <laughs> so we're on the road. And uh, this is working out pretty good. Blue can't see Ghost, which is good because we were told that he's not too keen on other dogs. So Ghost is back there. We can see her. She's not laying down. We were told she would probably be nervous the whole trip. So but she's back there. We we'll see ya. She probably don't want to see us anyway because she's scared. But yeah, we're on the road. Yeah, so now we have, so it took us an hour and a half to pick him up. Now we got to drive three hours north and drop him off. And then we got to drive about three and a half hours back home. It's not too bad. It does to end up taking up the whole day, but we get to help. We get to help all the dogs, and that totally makes it worth it. And I mean, it gets us out of the house for a little bit as well, so that's kind of nice. And we got people taking care of our dogs for a little bit today, so it works out pretty good. What do you think, huh? He's like, I don't know how I feel. <laughs> There's still a lot of blue ice over there. Huh. I didn't expect there to be ice, but apparently there is. There's still ice on the water. Wow, it looks so pretty. We picked a good day to do transport, Jamie. Nice blue skies. Saving some dogs. It's a good day. The dogs are gone. their next stop. You know what the coolest thing about doing these transports is? Some of the people that are watching this video have actually adopted dogs that we've transported. Like Lily. Right. We, we know the people that own Lily. Yeah, there's quite a few of them actually that we've transported that people from our audience have been adopted. So maybe Blue or Ghost will get adopted by somebody. 
homework first for sure. Um, but maybe one of you guys will get one of those dogs. Then that'd be cool. And then you can send us pictures. <laughs> uh, we're on our way back home. I think we've got three hours and 20 minutes to get home from where we're at. We're gonna go try to find food in the middle of nowhere. Literally. Uh, deer were eating some pine trees. I don't think I want to eat pine trees. They might be kind of sappy. potentially be snow clouds yeah so let's hope uh, the roads stay good and we make it home <laughs> oh my goodness we made it home we made it home hi <laughs> oh my goodness hi you girls have fun with greg oh, and we made it home we made it home i think somebody's sound asleep yeah, somebody's sound asleep. Yeah. Hey, Oakley. Hey, Oakley. Whoa, hi. <laughs> Shelby's like, well, let me kiss you. Hi. hi we made the home, huh, Dylan? I didn't mean to wake you from your nap. So it's like, oh, you woke me from a nap. Mirrors, <gasps> mirrors. Every time we transport huskies, I just want to come home and snuggle my dog so hard. Mm -hmm. oh, Shelby's like, whoa, wait, Dad, whoa. Mm -hmm. Dad, mm -hmm. Dad, you smell like a dog. Mm -hmm. you smell, you smell, <laughs> she's glued to your leg. <laughs> right here, right here, I smell a dog. I smell a dog on you. You smell a dog on him? You girls want to go outside? You want to go outside? You want to go outside? How oh, happy, how oh, happy, happy we're home. We made it! We left at 10 o'clock this morning. It's 7.30 at night. We did it. Oh. We did it. And I was just like, yay! <laughs> Let's now go! Yeah. What are you doing upside down, puppy? What are you doing? You're crazy. Memphis, I think you're broken. Memphis, are you broken? <laughs> hi. hi. She's like, oh, hey, Ooh, hi. You shocked me. Hi. Uh, I love you girls. I love all you girls. Hey, my chokey. How's it going, huh? She's like, I thought we were going outside. I woke up and now I need to go outside. <laughs> oh, you crazy dog. Crazy, crazy dog. Crazy, crazy dogs. All right, I'll let you, I will let you outside. I will, I will let you girls outside. All of you can go outside. Seriously, I got up to let you guys out and then I grabbed a drink, come back in here to work and you stole my seat. I'm glad we're back home. <laughs> She's like, you guys were gone all day. I just want to be close to you. That's a little too close. I need to sit there. <laughs> What's the deal, huh? She's been pacing for a good 30 minutes. I'm not sure what her deal is. We already went out. We already got you water. You had a treat. You're just trying to get comfy. Just having one of them nights when you're having a hard time getting comfy. Look at Shelby's showing you how to do it. That's how you do it. <laughs> Tomorrow, Oakley gets her stitches out. This time, hopefully for real, her incision looks really, really nice. So, we're gonna go tomorrow morning and get just go in there. Fine, that's the first time she's gone in there in 30 minutes, too. Oh, no. I just checked. There's nothing in there. You can go in there. I'm not sure what you want. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, she's going to get her stitches out tomorrow morning. I've been sitting here doing a little bit of work. She's been pacing around. Shelby fell asleep over there. Memphis, as always, is right here. She's like, I just want to be next to you because you were gone all day. Memphis, as always, is right here. She's got to be as close as possible. <laughs> She's like, I need extra snuggles because you snuggled some other dog today. Come on, Hokley, you can do it. You can do it, I believe in you. Yeah. Oh, maybe. You're all right. She's already had her pain pill today, too, so I'm not really sure what the deal is. Part of the joy of having an older dog. 
Yeah. At least this is normal compared to last week when we had all the issues. This is something Oakley's always done. She's always had, every once in a while, she just has a night where she can't fall asleep. Sometimes I wonder if it's the change in the weather, the humidity or something making her arthritis act up. But she's got her, her pain meds already, so. Hopefully she'll just lay down and go to sleep. I'm just going to lay here and keep watching TV until she does. Oh, oh, you can do it. We believe in you. We believe in you. You can do it. She's like, no. <laughs> she wants to. But she's not going to. Hey, look here. Hey, if I touch her, she'll jump. I don't want to make her jump. <sighs> what are we going to do with her, huh? I know. You can do it. You can do it. Or spin around again. Now can I pet you? Hey, how's it going? Yeah? Can I pet you? She's like, no. I just want to like your hand. All right, well, we're going to lay down here on the couch, and hopefully Oakley will lay down here pretty soon and fall asleep. If you guys are new to this channel and you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and share it with your friends to help us grow the audience, as always. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. And we will see you again soon. Good night, audience. You can do it, Oakley. We all believe in you. We believe in you. Oh, right there. Oh, see? You just gotta let me get the scratches in. There go some scratches. Some scratches. There go some scratches here. Some scratches here. Yeah, some scratches. <laughs> I know, it feels good, huh? Alright, good night, audience. And after about another 15 minutes, she finally laid down. I think she's comfy. I'll lay out here a little bit longer, then I'll go to bed.